Hi everybody, Gerdy Verwoerd here, Dare Great League Coach. And I work with women just like you, successful but unhappy in your career, always working and not living a real life anymore. I guide you back to your own trail in life. I guide you back to that place where you can start living your own life again. I help you reset your mind. I help you design your own life map. And once you've done that, I help you, support you as you start walking down your own trail again. Now I'm sitting here in the, uh, on the outskirts of um, National Park Hohetauern, because this is what you could call my backyard. And what I do here is um, I'm currently resetting my own mind. I've been working really hard, tenaciously almost, at, uh, at something which didn't quite work out as I wanted to. So I've put a lot of energy towards something that didn't pan out. And that is frustrating, I must say. That is um, disappointing. Uh, I put all this hard work in and it didn't work out the way I wanted to. And um, I have a tendency, I sort of went down a rabbit hole, you know, working really hard and trying to make it work anyways. And of course, that just didn't make it uh, any better. And in fact, it made it worse. It made me feel worse. And um, I needed a break. I needed to reset my own mind, which is why for the last couple of days I've come here. This is one of my favorite places in the world. This is um, very close to where I live and it's a very easy hike. It's some, a hike that anybody can do. But it is also away from everything. Yes, I have my uh, mobile with me. I can do a video with it. But there's no reception, no internet. So no disturbances. Just me, my mind and nature and the dog. So, what I wanted to talk to you about is um, how hiking can help you heal. Hiking is, um, for me, the most important thing I can do for myself and I can do with my clients when it comes to resetting our minds. Because, especially because around here, where you go into the mountains, you can just as well ditch your device because there's no reception. There's only nature. There's only you and your mind and your thoughts and the meditative act of hiking. So that's also why hiking is such an important part of what I do, of what I do with my clients. It is very important, I believe, to step out of the environment that you've been stuck in, that you found yourself stuck in for such a long time when you are um, just being stressed all the time, when you're working really hard, when you have no time for anything else, when you have no time to, to um, or when you feel you have no time to just sit back, relax, Think about nothing else but how can you change things in your life so that you can start living again. And I have to remind myself of that every now and again because I come from the same place that you are in right now. Overworked, overstressed and um, not living my, excuse me, my, re my own life anymore. So, and sometimes I find myself falling back into that behavior and I have to consciously pull myself out again, as I'm doing right now, because I have been uh, falling back a little bit into old behavior that isn't helpful to me. So what does it mean? What do we do when, we, when you go with me into the mountains on a hike to heal experience? What, first of all, what I do is I help you, I, I, we talk about what um, you want to achieve, what your goal is. Uh, I design a program that fits your particular need. And the basis is uh, for everybody the same, but I 
tailor make it to your needs, to your experience. Not just the coaching part, but also the hiking part. There's hikes. Hiking is possible for anybody. If you can put one foot in front of the other, it is possible for you to hike also in the mountains. There's easy hikes and there's intermediate hikes and there's difficult hikes. And I, can, I know these mountains so well that I can put together a program that fits your particular experience. Not just your particular experience, you will also be stretched a little bit. What are the benefits of hiking? In combination with coaching especially, hiking is like I already said, a meditative experience. It is especially when you go for longer hikes and when they're a bit strenuous, there comes a point where it's just you and the mountain, where you have to focus on what you're doing and you have to forget everything else. The fact that you have to, that you have no reception, so there's no possibility of phone calls that are going to interfere with your experience, there's no access to internet, is also helpful. And the best part of it, or a great contributor at least, is the fact that you get to do it in surroundings as beautiful as these. I have yet to meet the first person that isn't in awe of the experience of walking, hiking in this beauty, uh, in this beautiful surroundings. And especially when you go deeper into the mountains, because where I am now, it's very easy to reach. So it's us it can be pretty busy. But when the snow is gone on these mountains behind me, you can hike up there as well. And there I often find myself just by myself, with my clients and nobody else. And that, to me, is the true mountain experience. When you are somewhere where there's nobody else really, and you're, it's just you, and nature, and your thoughts. So when you come with me into the mountains, that's um, a special experience. It is special because you get to reconnect with nature. It is special because to, you get to reset your mind. And it is special because you get to combine it with coaching as well. And it's special because it's tailor-made for you. I hope you'll join me. If you're interested, send me a message, send me a PM, contact me. And um, I hope you have a great day. As always, go there greatly. Bye-bye.